Of, we are fighting to make sure the team remains in the Premier League, which we are working towards. It us that we have one game to go, and uh, we are not down to the lowest, but we still believe we can still win the Premier League for next season. A lot of saves today, eh, from uh, the beginning of the game until to the end, you consider the goal from Stefan Yazizki. Uh, what's your feelings on that game? What can you say? Yeah, for me, Yonga is a big club, and when you are playing against a big club, you have to be careful. And especially a club like Tabora United, so we give our best, we did what we could do, but at the end of the day, we didn't get the result we wanted, so we give our glory to God. We are going to go back home and see where we didn't get it right against Namungo and see what we can do. After the lose to get to today, what do you tell the uh, Tabora United fans? Yeah, I'm telling Tabora United fans, be patient for us, we are going to keep the team in the Premier Division for next season. The target of the Young African squad, the Azizki to score today, and the Azizki scored. Uh, can you say anything? Yeah, for me, uh, I think I feel bad because I talked to my defense because I knew from the way they were playing, I knew they wanted him to score. And I asked them to give him the contact marking, but at the end of the day, he scored. So, it's football, anything can happen. Did you promise to yourself that uh, Azizki not to score today? No, no, I didn't promise myself that it's football, anything can happen. So, it was just a game. At the end of the day, he scored and I give glory to God. Uh, you are last to comment on Azizki, how you see him, how he play. Just to talk anything about Aziz. Who is that? About Aziki? Yeah. I think uh, for me, he's one of the best players I've seen in my career. He's a very good player, a very hardworking guy, and uh, very determined to succeed. I think he will go find his.